We fucking love video games. All right, all my gamer friends, Gamescom has officially started in Cologne, Germany. Gamescom is probably the biggest games focused convention. Uh, it's like what E3 used to be. E3 is uh, is gone and uh, lots of new announcements and stuff. But this was an announcement that is related to my channel. And I think it's really cool. They had Tim Miller went up on stage and got a little choked up, which was really nice. We've been working on this show for three years. Um, I get a little upset, <laughs> choked up. Sorry. I cry a lot. And announced that a Prime Video Series premiere and first teaser trailer for the adult anthology series, Secret Level. Tim Miller being the director of the first Deadpool movie. So, so the Deadpool franchise owes a lot to him because this was an unproven franchise. And considering Deadpool Wolverine just came out, is officially the highest grossing R-rated movie of all time, which is this series owes a lot to Tim Miller, but he left during Deadpool 2 over creative differences. And I honestly don't even remember who uh, directed the film. So essentially every episode would be one game, I assume. So that's really cool. They're like adapting a game per episode. August 20th, Today Prime Video announced during the Gamescom opening night live the captivating new adult animated series, Secret Level. It is our love letter to games. Featuring original short stories set within the worlds of some of the most beloved video games. From Amazon, MGM Studios, and Blur Studios, the creators of the really awesome Love, Death, and Robots that was on Netflix comes 15 mind-bending episodes. Secret Level will be available exclusively on Prime in over 240 countries and territories worldwide on December 10th. So now I need to get Prime again for when that comes out. Each episode of Secret Level serves as a gateway to a new adventure unlocking exciting from beloved gaming classics and highly anticipated new titles. Holy crap. I just noticed one that hasn't even been released yet and they're adapting that? Okay. We'll get that when we get down to the list. Prepare for an unforgettable journey where Amazon, MGM Studios, and Gaming's Finest Unique for its first-of-a-kind event that brings together more game IP in a single series that's ever been done before below is the incredible list of games who inspired the 15 epic stories found in secret level so the list in alphabetical order armored core never played it now this one is weird to me immediately because concord hasn't officially been released yet and it's a playstation only game so it's interesting that they're not going with cross console games but this game has already stirred up controversy for being a quote-unquote free-to-play game on PlayStation or a hero shooter, but you do have to pay for it. I'm no, I don't know if they're just making if if it's just about paying for it up front and then everything else is free. Because I mean, at the same time, in a free-to-play game, you could spend way more than it costs to buy a game on microtransactions. But continuing on, Crossfire, Dungeons and Dragons. I'm not sure what that means exactly because Dungeons and Dragons is a huge IP with Exodus. Honor of Kings, Mega Man, New World, Aeternum, never heard of that one. Pac-Man, this one just says PlayStation, so I'm not sure what that's about. Highlighting various PlayStation Studios in in one episode. Sifu, that one's kind of, that one's pretty new, so that's interesting. Spelunky, a game I never played. Outer Worlds, cool game. Arnold Tournament, that's unusual. Warhammer 40,000. Secret Level is created and executive produced by tim miller dave wilson serves as executive producer and supervising director secret level is a new adult animated series featuring original stories set in some of the worlds of the most beloved video games from the creative minds of love death and Rose. so that is really cool i'm excited about this because it is a show exclusively about game adaptations considering how amazing fallout was on prime and they're going to be doing other adaptations like god of war i think it's god of war it could be gears of war but they're doing some things over there on amazon prime that i like i'm interested in seeing this december 10th we got a couple months away i'm also interested in how the hell they're going to do concord I mean, it hasn't even come out yet and it's already getting shit on some unusual choices like sifu and spelunky pac-man i wonder how they're going to do that this game i've never even heard of 
Mega Man is cool. I like him. So yeah, this is cool. And I'm going to follow up this video with a look at the trailer just to see anything that's cool in it, whatnot. And I'll include some clips of Mr. Tim Miller getting on stage and getting choked up, which I like. So a very cool announcement, and I'm very interested in how this is going to turn out. As you can see, the animation looks really good. And I'm going to do a little breakdown after this to see if I can figure out which is for which franchise. So I'm going to get into that later on. But for right now, people, I would love for you, you to tell me what you think about this. I think this is really awesome, and I'm looking forward to it. Uh, but until then, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you, gamers.